So what we are now seeing is the Afghans who prefer India any day, including the Taliban to Pakistan. Then you have the Tariqe Taliban Pakistan, which is an offshoot of the Afghans, of course. Then you have that Al Qaeda fellow running around, yeah. also known as. Uh, then you have that Islamic State, also known as Daesh. They are running around. So everybody and his grandmother, every wretched Islamic terrorist, is running around there, doing all kinds of funny things. And Pakistan suddenly realizes what a mess it is in. Incidentally, not many people know that in 1919, the first Indian government in exile was formed in Kabul at the end of the First World War. But then the war ended and the Germans lost, etc. And then the British put pressure on the Afghan Emir. He was funding this government. Um, I've forgotten the name of the person, Raja something who established it. Just recently, Prime Minister inaugurated a university named after this person in Uttar Pradesh. So he was the head of the government in exile, Indian government in exile, 1990. So we've had a very close relationship with the Afghans. You know, Kabuliwala, et cetera, from childhood, we have heard about that. My family is from Ghazni in yeah. Afghanistan. 